Right, well, I got a game against somebody who wasn't a complete little bitch this time. Unlike the last time I tried this fucking team. Uh, let's see his team first. Uh, he's, he's got some really pacey wingers with Mane, Mane, how the fuck you say it, Townsend. He's the same as me, got a couple of silver players. Uh, climbs really quick, as you can imagine. His whole. Both his fullbacks and wingers are really pacey. And his centre backs are really pacey. Kozak's a good target man in the game. Uh, Coutinho, I don't know why he's playing him so deep, but he's pretty good running forward. Sigurdsson was. I didn't notice in the entire game. Matter was pretty decent for him. Uh, yeah, Matter scored a goal. Kozak assisted it with a knockdown, pretty much. I can't remember. That's right. My team looks. Jimenez Jimenez. How even else? I got a 9.5. Cersei got an 8.7. Uh, Midfielder's pretty crap, apart from Aquino, they were just there. Oh, that's pretty much their job. Um, just one winger going forward and the strikers are the best part of this formation, to be honest. The centre backs are actually really good this game. Uh, Tremolinus had a bit of difficulties against um, shit, what was it? Townsend. But Di Marcos just had a uh, Mane in his back pocket. I think he was expecting Mane to keep up pacing him because just kept going for it and Adi Marcos was even quicker because Mane is like 90 pace but Adi Marcos has like 93 pace so uh, yeah. Uh, Cersei got a goal, Jimenez got two goals, there's this one each of Cersei, Jimenez and Aquino. Shots, I didn't get too many shots, he's pretty different too. Passes, pretty decent. Rafinha, I don't know why Jimenez has the um, key golden stat thing there because Rafinha had a lot better passing rate. Joe was completed, yeah Jimenez got taken out a lot because uh, Sarko and that one Sarko is Mar Mangala because Mangala is good. Yeah. Uh, crosses, I did one cross the entire game and it actually completed and that, you'll see that one. Tackles one. Uh, but the fact that he's meant to be the more defensive than midfielders, Suarez didn't do too well but so that's pretty much keeps everything pretty tight defensively, so I don't know. Uh, maybe he was just good there but it's a body blocking things. Six saves, he had two, but yeah, goodness. Uh, uh, 493 coins, I'll take that. Here's the goals. Well, here's him hitting the post first. So he got a cross. That's not the post, that's the fucking crossbar. I can't really do much against Kozak because he's so fucking tall, he's like 6'5 or something. Matters goal. Threw a ball over the top, I hate them. Set off on open goal. Jimenez is goal, this is nice. The actual cross, I wanted it to go to the middle, not there, but whatever. Nice finish, with a volley, Cersei's goal. The pace! And then nice finish. Yeah, that came off me. You can see uh, another save. Uh, in the post. Yeah, it's, yeah, that could have gone a bit better. And Jimenez is up a goal. I don't know what Mangala was doing, but that's the goals. Um, when you're playing against somebody who's not a complete little pace or ultra defensive counter attacking little bitch, it's actually quite fun. I really recommend the 442 to be honest. If you have if you have two box to box players it seems to work better than a player who sits and a player to go forward. The um Serie A team with Strootman and uh Nine Golan. Both have high high work rate if I have uh, Strootman sit back a bit and Nine Golan go forward a bit but they both still do both. But I really recommend high high in the build or at least medium medium I guess more than Med high or high med because it, it just seems to work better in all rounds rather than splitting your midfield up a bit but I'll stick with this for now. Uh, I've got both my partnerships are uh, the smaller speedier guy Cersei and uh, Rossi and a taller dude Jimenez and uh, shit, what's his name? Babacar, Bubacar, whatever. Uh, Wieners they do the job that we're going to do, but I just prefer to 
give a bit of space out wide so I've got someone to pass to just to keep the ball going. I like to switch around between passing and counter-attacking and with a little bit of skill uh, just all around normal play I guess. It works pretty well with this formation. I didn't think it would be too good because well, you know, it's just a flat 4-4-2. But it seems to work pretty well as you can go as we've got the neutral work rates all right. Uh, front 2 just seems to work pretty well in the last few games and yeah, I'm about done with this video now. Uh, 3 wins, 1 loss.